What's up guys, Brandon Slavinsky here. This is a beautiful song. I saw one of my best friends get married to him, walk down the aisle, and uh, it's Life Houses You and Me. It's a awesome love song. So if you, you know, got a lady friend and you're kind of trying to, you know, or something like that, then this might be your song. We'll find out, who knows? Make sure you post a comment and be like, I totally use it and I'm winning now. So check it out. Starting off with a G. Three, two, zero, zero, three, three. And then to a C add nine. All right, and you're gonna mute, and it's gonna be three two zero three three. We're kind of gonna keep our our ring finger and pinky down at those top two strings. And then a D sus four slash F sharp. That's gonna go like this. And that's gonna be your thumb on the second fret, low E. Then you're gonna mute. It's gonna be zero two three three. Very interesting chord, isn't it? And then a G slash B is going to be mute, two, zero, zero, three, three. And then an E minor seven, which is zero, two, two, zero, three, three. To a D sus four, which looks just like this. And you're going to mute but typically the top two. You're kind of okay if this one rings out a little bit. But it's gonna be mute, zero, zero, two, three, three. And then to the C at nine again. So check it out. This is where it gets awesome. So just like this. So. C at 9, the D sus, the G slash B, E minor 7, to the D, to the C. It's a lot of complex chords. I wish there was an easier way to say it. What day is it? And in one month, the clock never seems to be so alive. I can't keep up. It's, so that's the verse, okay? So then we go into the chorus, right? Cause it's you and me. It's an A7 sus4. So you're gonna mute the low E, and then it's gonna be open, cause that's an A, and then two, open, three, three. So from the G to the A sus, A7 sus, sus4. Oh my God, I can't speak. And all of the people to the C at nine, which we've learned, with nothing to do, with nothing to lose. To that D sus4 on the tail end. Cause it's you and me, and all of the people, and I don't know why, I can't keep my eyes off of you. So you end on that C at nine. One more time, through the full chorus, one. Cause it's you and me And it's all of the people With nothing to do Nothing to lose Cause it's you and me And it's all of the people And I don't know why I can't keep my eyes off of you So that's the chorus. So we've learned the verse, we've got the chorus, now we got to do the breakdown, right? Something about you now. So it goes from a B minor, which is mute, two, four, four, three, two, to a C, a normal C. What? A normal C. Mute, three, two, zero, one, zero. So something about you now, to a G, normal G. I can't quite, on that quite, you're gonna do a D, a normal D, mute, zero, zero, two, three, two. Figure it out. That E minor seven, okay? So, something about you now. I can't figure out. And then an A, an a minor, normal A minor. So that's mute, zero, two, two, one, zero. 
everything she does is beautiful to a D, which we've learned. And then a B minor, everything she does is right. I'm sorry, C minor. Everything she does is right. You could do that for fun, but the C minor is just right up from that B minor. It's going to be mute, three, five, five, four, three. And that's the breakdown. So take those chords, make them with the rhythm, get yourself straight and tight, and you guys are gonna be able to play Lifehouse's most amazing song, You and Me. So, hope you guys enjoyed this lesson, and we'll see you next time. Hey guys, thank you so much for watching this video. Be sure to check out our other awesome tutorial videos, and if you have any requests, send them to requests at mahalo.com.